So I'm given some information about the square ABCD and the line PB and the line DA. And my task is to find the length PD. So you really, to understand this topic, you need to be comfortable with all things Y equals MX plus C. So you need to be able to understand gradient and intercept, particularly the intercept in this, uh, well no, both the gradient and intercept, properties of gradient and intercept. So, um, let's start off with y equals minus 2x plus 6. Well, that will tell me um, two things, really. It will tell me that the point D is 6, and therefore the distance from D to O is 6. The coordinate will be at naught 6, but we cut at 6 on the y-intercept. So that leaves us with having to find the distance OP and then simply adding that on to 6. Well, this is very important that we can see that PB is perpendicular to AD. So we can find the equation of the perpendicular line to y equals minus 2x plus 6. First of all, we can get the gradient. So we'll do that first. The gradient is going to be the negative reciprocal. That's a rule you need to know that the gradient of a perpendicular line has a negative reciprocal of the line it is perpendicular to. So the gradient of dA is minus 2, which means 1 over minus minus 2, the gradient of the perpendicular line, PB, will be a half x. Now we don't know the intercept at the moment, but we can find the point A. And, and then we can use that point to find the intercept. Once we have the intercept, we'll know the gap between 0 and P. Well, point A is found when minus 2x plus 6 Point A is on the line DA is equal to 0. Remember the x-axis is the y equals 0 line. And that will be found when x equals minus 3. Uh, sorry, plus 3. So minus 2 times uh, 3 is minus 6. Plus 6 is 0. So we now know then that... Um, that the point 3 naught, 3 naught is on our uh, equation PB. So if we substitute in the 3, we see that y equals a half of 3 plus c. Now the, um, sorry, the naught, we can replace the uh, y with 0 as we're, we're substituting in our point 3 naught. So when y is naught, x, um, a half times x plus c equals naught. So we get 3 over 2 plus c equals naught, so c equals minus 1.5. So the intercept then of the perpendicular line is minus 1.5. So it's quite straightforward to get PD now, because PD will be 6 plus there's the 6 and then the 1.5. So the answer is 7.5. There's no units given, so we'll just leave it as 7.5.